And we're wondering if you guys can see how high that is. Down here, underneath all this, see this rock here? Underneath there is a cave, a little cave that I imagine like kangaroos would sleep in, I guess. You reckon, Chris? Yeah. Hopefully not snakes, because I'm going in. What is that? Those are the rocks at the bottom. Amazing, oh yeah, there's the other trail. We were going to go up that way. I found a cool, Chris found me a cool walking stick. Thank God for it. There's tons of energy out here. So we're going to show you down um, into this cave down here. We just passed a whole family. It was lucky we passed them in the right spot. It's very na narrow, isn't it? What is it? Oh yeah. What is it? Oh wow. That's cool. He's all shiny. Huh. This is this is where we've been. We we went up this huge trailblazer trail. I mean, it was a trailblazer. And we were going to continue to go, but it was so very hard. So we kind of started to come down again. Hmm. Oh, I've got these lights in the camera again. Awesome. Okay, we're going to go down here. So got to go back out this way. So I'll just take you with us. Wait a sec. There's little little shelves like that. So underneath shelf is where you find things like amethyst, things like that. They're underneath. You go down and underneath. Down and across, don't you? So this is the trail. See these rocks here? I hope you can see how steep it is. Okay. I'll take my stick. Yeah. Chris is going to just take over so I can get down. Go ahead. I'll show you if I can. See that, see that big, show them all that big rock there. only come through one gate so we hopefully you're enjoying enjoying this because we're going to be taking you a lot of different places since we're getting the hiking bug just about kills us though every time <laughs> Actually, quite cold. We were sweating. Look at that eyes in it. All right, I'll hold it. Yeah, we'll yeah, we'll get a a light. Hang on, check it out. So we were up there where that tree is. I can see a face in that rock. I'm going to zoom in on the face. Can you see him? See him? He's an indigenous warrior there. 
Yeah. Hello. <laughs> oh, that's what I'm like. Talk to things. A bigger rock sitting right there on its own. All right, we're going to go have a look at this cave. So I'd say kangaroos pop in this. Oh, you can kind of see. See that shelf? It's all some sort of quartz, I reckon. It's kind of letting them see in here. It's not really that big. It's just like really interesting, isn't it? We found um, on the map, there's a whole lot of caves we can go to. It's actually, it's quite a long drive, but we're going to go and take you there. Isn't this cool? A shelf under there. So yeah, I guess they sleep in here when it's gets raining and everything. Get some shelter. Perhaps the Aboriginals did sleep in here as well. So that was that was our great find. <laughs> that was the steep thing we came down. Look at her. What a beautiful tree. Okay, I'm getting the light energy through everything now. Wow. More caves up there? No. Oh. Oh. This is amazing, this place. About 20 minutes drive at the most from the other conservation park. The next one that we're going to go to at some point is uh, got a waterfall. Apparently, this one has got one as well, but we don't know. It must be miles away. And it's getting late in the day. We've got to get down here somehow. <laughs> really steep. And yes, we found tons of quartz. But this is a conservation park, so I'm not sure if we're actually there to take him. Just everywhere you look, there's just all these um, big, massive rocks, ledges. Yeah, that's where it's we work. Hmm? It's like a mushroom. Yeah. Look how quiet it is. <laughs> wow, well, this is what I wanted to show you around this thing. Forgot to get up there. Looks like you can get up around there. Look at these rocks. Holy moly. Whew. And of course, someone had to be silly with spray paint. Why would they do that? Oh, just leave it alone. Whoa. whoa. I'm sure you can climb up on that. Hmm? From around the back, yeah. It's just really, really rocky. It's deep. They're deep in the woods. Oh. Wow. Gosh, 
We're so lucky in this country, aren't we? Huh. Well, it's going like oh, um, orange colour there, the rocks. I wonder if that's all sandstone. All I can say is it's huge. There's a little seat. Well, there should have been more of them up top. <laughs> nope. Not too far from where my Grammy is staying. And she hasn't been very well. There's a little shelf under there. I suppose the snakes would get under there. Looks like one of the mushroom things up there. Be a creek at some stage, eh? It's had to have been a creek. It's amazing. Look where we go, there's those beautiful lights. No! <laughs> I should be actually watching where I'm going, but I'm not. Yeah, so the creek must go under here in this heavy rains. We haven't had that much rain, I'd say. Not that much. Sometimes it comes down a fair bit and then you don't have it for a while. If you don't live in Australia, it's good to, to see all of this. Okay, we're back at the road. Oh, I love these old trees. Gosh, it's beautiful. Next time we'll have to go up this mammoth hill. <laughs> okay. Time for us to head home. Poor old dogs will be waiting on us. So I hope you enjoyed having a little bit of a look.
never know where we'll be next time.